And you mentioned lots of eccentric acts yes. this year. Yes. Can you name some which have been the most bonkers? I think for me this year, one of the interesting things has been the acts that have come forward and put their lives on the line. <laughs> there have been a few moments where I genuinely, and I don't know if we'll see it in this episode today, I have not been able to watch. Whereas like Simon absolutely loves it. The more dangerous, the more excited he gets and the more scared I get. And that's kind of been like a reoccurring theme. And I don't know what's in the air, but I think because every year he says I like the danger. So everybody's thought, right, <laughs> let's step up the danger. Let's go for it. We had a hat juggler where literally he just wore five hats and span them out in the audience and initially you go this isn't really going to work it was amazing because these hats are like special hats where he spins them out and brings them back um, we've had a guy that um, sings with his goat um, that will obviously be on Britain's Got More Talent welcome one and all and Amanda, you've already poured three glasses of water over Simon's head. What, what else can we expect from you, outrageous more antics? More water. More water. Um, it's like a wet t-shirt competition for Simon this year. He, and, and he didn't want to get changed because he knew that he looked good wet. <laughs> <laughs> I know you haven't got a golden buzzer, but is there a particular act that you've seen so far that you would press it for? Yeah, there's, there's one act that um, one of the judges buzzed in for, for their golden buzzer, and I think could be the winner. Can you say, is it Alicia's one? Maybe it is. 